What's up guys? Uh, welcome to a new video. Today we are in saint remy provence with Sam. She's somewhere over there. <laughs> We're exploring a town in the south of France and I decided to try and shoot some street photography. I've got here my Fujifilm X-T3. I'm filming this video uh, on the uh, Fujifilm X-T4 and a little bit on the X-T3 as well. I'm taking photos with this one, trying out two different lenses. So I have the 16 to 80 mil on here and I have the 18 to 55 mil on there. And I'm gonna try and share with you guys some of the shots that I can take, explore the town, and make a little vlog about it. Sam is coming, I don't know if you can see her over there. <laughs> so, let's go explore and I'll be putting up my uh, my shots on the on the vlog here and sharing with you guys. Yay! This little exercise has been really good for me right now. I just realized I've been taking more photos of people. Usually I, I wait for a place to be empty so I can take a shot and right now I'm trying to incorporate people and try to take photos of them without them noticing me, which is kind of like, it's very awkward, let's just say. But yeah, it's, it's an interesting uh, exercise today. Get it out of my way and take photos that make me feel uncomfortable. But I guess when you do street photography, I mean, it's more interesting, I guess, when you get actual activity in it otherwise it's just a little a little boring so yeah making an effort all right filming uh, today is kind of a mess I'm trying to do a video but at the same time Sam is also doing a video on our channel and we keep switching back and forth between cameras and between like photo and video um, it's a little bit of a mess it might be a little bit of all over the place but hopefully it still looks nice. Um, most of the shots I'm getting today, I'm thinking uh, I have a wider uh, lens, 16 mil, so I'm trying to get wider shots. I'm used to get like a lot of like close-up shots and zoomed in, but I'm trying to trying something different. I don't know if it's coming out right or not. I'll, I'll see it when I edit the photos later.
okay, we just arrived into that little square and uh, taking photos of those cats. And they kind of like played around and jumped around the river. It was very, very fun uh, trying to get some shots. And then we figured that's probably where it is the best place to take the thumbnail photo for our videos. So we stayed there for like 15 minutes, 20 minutes and trying to get the shot. And now we are thirsty, We're trying to find a place where we could sit and have a drink. So, first impression, first thoughts on the Fujifilm X-T4. First of all, the battery life. Uh, we still have more than half on this camera and I'm almost, I'm almost dead on this one. So definitely the battery has been improved immensely and I'm very happy about that. Second, the picture quality looks really, really good on the X-T4. I really think there's a big difference. I didn't, I didn't think there was gonna be that much of a difference actually on the picture quality, but they did improve it quite a lot. Now it's time for a drink. All right guys, this is it for today's video. Thank you guys for watching. Thanks for your support. Uh, I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, like, please leave a comment down below and let me know what you think. Subscribe if you haven't subscribed already and um, like the video if you liked it. Today was very good. I figured out a lot of things about the X-T4 compared to the X-T3, which I'm used to shoot with. There's a pretty big difference between the two and I'm very happy we invested money into the X-T4. Still a lot of tourists today in the south of France, but yeah, it was, it was a very nice getaway. Uh, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Uh, probably the next video I'm gonna shoot will be in London because we're going there uh, for some friend's wedding uh, next week. So I'm very, very excited about that. And uh, I'll, I'll guess I'll see you there. Peace, guys. Bye.